Welcome to Alaska Duck Adventure. Welcome back boys and girls and you're not gonna believe it. It's been one week and this happened. Check this out. And you're not believe how big they got. They're like three or four times the size of when we first got them. They sure do grow fast. If they can stand up you guys can see how big they are. It feels like overnight they grow like an inch. It's crazy. I wanted to give you guys an update. So far, it doesn't stink in here. Giving them uh, millworms, and that makes their poop stink. Make sure you manage the water, that's very important. So what I do is I change out the towel about three or four times a day, and I make sure they have plenty of water, especially in the morning and before I go to bed. That one container lasts all day. I just make sure they have fresh and clean water and food with their grit. I change out their bedding approximately every three days. I do spot cleaning on you know bad spots, on spots that get dirty, you know if it gets wet or just really poopy in one area. Clean up that spot for them. And then <laughs> and then you take the shavings, I put it into a trash bag and then I'm gonna transfer it over and put it in the garden. So it doesn't go to waste. I'm getting everything ready for them so they can go outside. I'm just waiting for the snow to melt and it to get warmer. But the kids are enjoying spending time with them. They wake up and they want to say good morning and they check up on the duckies and they gotta say good night and if we leave they say goodbye. So they are absolutely loving these ducks. They've had their first time playing in water. I'll try to link the video above. The water wasn't that deep, but got a chance to jump in there and experience what playing in water feels like. They're getting more comfortable around us. I am able to pick them up. I mean, they still run back and forth, but they're more willing to let me hold them and pet them and give them some attention. So overall, it's a very good experience. So no regrets on getting them. They are definitely um, a lot of work. I imagine if you have more than two, I mean, it's just even more work. I can't wait to get them out and have them run around the yard and a little more free than just being in this tub. I do take them out and let them on the garage floor with a little baby gate so they can run around. It's very adorable to hear their feet smack the concrete. But they're not on the concrete for very long because that's not good for their feet. But it is adorable. So I guess I'll let them stay here and just relax enjoy their time. I'll touch back with you guys in a little bit. Alright boys and girls, we're coming down to the end of the day. So they got plenty of food. And they got water. Looks like they were having fun while I was gone, splashing around. So it looks like it's already soaked. They've only had that there for maybe... I don't even say 20 minutes. So, looks like they're having fun. I hope you guys can see how big they're getting. Let me try to get the camera down there so you guys can see better. Of course. Now they're going to lay down. They're absolutely huge now. Alright, I appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Until the next video, thanks for watching. Bye.